Okay, I'm back. Uh, I learned a few things since the live stream. Um, the big one being that I just had this thing completely hooked up wrong. Uh, I had the ribbon cable plugged into this uh, IDC connector thing here. This little jack is going in like that. That is not the right way to do that. Uh, this connector right here plugs in like so. And the ribbon cable, this end of it, is supposed to plug in right here, which is what this is for. So let's solder this on and then plug this ribbon cable in. Um, and there was something else too. Um, I think there was some issues with like setting up the library, but this is the main issue, I hope. We'll see if uh, putting this on changes things. I'm gonna solder this on right now and we'll see what happens. at least try to get this thing on straight, right? The least I can do. Come on. Have I ever mentioned that I hate SMG soldering? And this one's not even that bad. This is pretty large. I just hate SMG. That wasn't even in the camera frame. Well, you'll get to see this half of it at least. I don't know if anyone else has this problem, but like my soldering iron gets so freaking dirty so fast. Like, I use other people's soldering irons. I don't have to clean the tip nearly as often as I do with this one. I don't know if, like, this is just a 40 watt Heiko. Um, doesn't have any temperature settings, so I don't know if maybe it's like that it gets too hot. So it's like oxidizing the solder more. I'm really not sure. I know I'm, I'm using the same solder as my friend Dave uses. And when I use his solder and his soldering iron, I don't have this problem with the uh, stuff with the soldering tip getting so dirty. All right, this is awful. Um, I'm going to put some paste flux because these are not quite soldering the way I want. And like my paste flux is such a mess now. It's um, just gone completely like gooey because I lost the lid for it. And I don't have a proper thing to apply it with, so I'm just applying it with a little piece of wire here. What am I doing? I'm going to um, 
sort of like reflow this. Just gonna go and touch each one. Get them nice and cleaned up here. Okay. That last one. Or the first one. This is the first one I soldered. Yeah, those all look pretty good. Okay, I'm going to grab my power supply. Get the soldering iron out of here. Get the solder. So, I don't know if any of y'all have seen this power supply. This is a Heath kit power supply I got. Um, I got it from a dead man. Um, that's not as interesting of a story as it sounds like. Um, but yes, I got it from a dead man. And um, it's old. It's a transistorized power supply. Um, and it's Heath built, not Heath kit. So I assume that means that this is something that came reassembled from um, Heath kit store. You know, it's not current limited. You can only adjust the voltage. Okay, so we're gonna give it five volts. And I think my phone is running out of memory because it says I only have 59 minutes and 18 seconds of recording left. So I'm gonna have to move some of my videos onto my spare hard drive. Okay, so this is supposed to plug in like that, and then this is supposed to plug in like that, and um, where's my screwdriver? All right, this is gonna have to do. I don't wanna go in the house and look for my other screwdriver. So tonight, when I was almost home, I noticed on one of the corners near my house a notice of a public hearing coming up. And then I noticed a notice for a public hearing on another corner by my house and another corner by my house. And so these things are basically on every street corner. And they're... Um, A public notice for, um, what is it? It's for, like, the city relinquishing a future street, whatever the heck that means. All right, let's give this power and see what happens. All right, so the uh, ESP is on. But I'm not getting a blue light. Let's just press restart and see what happens. Hey! Hey! Oh my god! Look at that! Look at that. Can you see that? It's like hard to see. Okay, let me uh, turn the light on. Yeah! I got it working! Pixel time! Pixel time! Okay! Well, we're in business! I wish I could have got this working in the live stream last night because that would have been a lot more interesting than me flailing around. Um, but it works, so uh, yeah, it's exciting. So um, yeah, I'm gonna call it a day for this video. Yeah, I don't think there's anything else to do. Okay, bye.